Yeah, you know, I want to see like the ground pounds, the the car cargo throws, giant punches, all giant that good punch. stuff. Yeah, bro. give him the wind up. And uh, IDK, Mr. By My Book, is indeed going DK. And this is an interesting matchup against Rosalina and Luma, who we don't see a lot of. Well, I don't see a lot of in my region, at least. Yeah, I mean, this is a character that you definitely was in the spotlight in the previous game. Not yeah. so much anymore, you know. Some characters, some players really think that this character may just be good for certain matchups. But at the same time, you know, there's a couple players like Zinin who's trying to make it work. Yeah, and I mean, uh, even the buzz has really started to bring out Rosalina more often. Yeah, and it's going to be a really interesting matchup to see, like you know, how uh, IDK can like really like circumvent or keep his like pressure going with the with the grab combos when when Luma's out. That's true, but it's like extremely easy to to eliminate Luma. So while Luma may be a problem, like especially being a big body, always going to have like that active hitbox from Luma or just the threat of being broken out. Okay, my man's in, in the handling as well. I, I would say he was handling it very well, but he just got the hands. He is out of there. <laughs> One stock on, and uh, IDK handling it very beautifully. I don't care. That right, forward is going to keep IDK off stage, but the wind up and the recovery going to put a good amount of damage onto Luma. Wow, jab and just a little bit of spin action is all it took. I'm really surprised that kill. That, that was that. I mean, that, it, that looked like it had like. The least amount of knockback, but he still died from it anyway. But ooh, I'm, I'm always coming. a little bit sus whenever uh, a, a spin or or a rapid jab really take a stock, especially after the ledge. I know there are some jabs that are really strong, but every single time I just see a jab take a stock, I'm like, are we okay with that? I'm not. <laughs> not, on no, not on no DK. Okay, well, Luma got to pay the price on that one. Get the grab combos going. You might want to put everything you can on oh. this one. And another back throw getting... Separation from the Luma, I like it. But yeah, it was really smart too, because not only did she, not only did IDK separate Luma from Rosalina, but then he took the opportunity to, like, while they were separated, to really get rid of the Luma. But now we see a back throw coming out from Zen here, trying to set up for the down air, but recovering just a little bit too low. IDK not gonna be able to make it backstage. And I'm wondering if that was the fear that allowed that, like, made him like not try to snap the ledge, or was it just a miss input or something? But either way, that stock's gonna be gone as and then. Uh, in the lead right now, not by too, too much. So let's we'll see if IDK can go to work right now. Okay, Luma's gone. That's honestly been the big threat of this game. And Luma continues to just be a menace to IDK. Down tilt's going to whip from Zihin and good up tilt. Here we go, and the back air caught him uh, slipping off stage. And now here we go. 46% on him, so not that bad of a, of a deficit. And that nearly got erased. Yeah, what I'm looking for is to really put Zinhin around the 70, 80 mark. Oh, the down air actually sent IDK up into the stage. That's kind of that's kind of weird, <laughs> but I understand. Like, Anyways, it looked it, like the game plan for IDK right there was to get Zinhin to about 70 or 80 percent. Try and sit center stage, force uh, Zinhin to approach, and then get a grab for that pseudo uh, ding dong. Yeah, I mean the kind of like the subtle nuances that kind of continue in this game from the last one is that. Being big is kind of trash. <laughs> being being large and having all these large hitboxes where you can easily get like two frames or stage spiked or anything like that, it's kind of bad. But at the same time, there are ways to work around it. And let's see if IDK can find those ways in this game too. So far, this man is uh he's uh down by one. That's true. Okay, where well, we see the jabs coming out, dash attack, up tilts, still connecting. Now that these early percent combos shouldn't be working anymore. Right, and this is uh, part of Zanin's, uh, Zanin's game plan right here, is just keeping the DK at bay, trying to just space him out with Luma. But right now, this man is getting grabbed and trying to go for the uh, the dirty dong, not going to get it. Yeah, good amount of mash coming from Zenhin. IDK was forced to do the up throw and trying to try to follow up with an up air instead of doing for the, the cargo throw up or up air. Right, disadvantage right now for DK. And uh, big punish opportunity coming here, but only going for the down smash. Probably thinking, probably thinking that's all he had time for. Okay, getting landing a down air, sending Zenhin across stage and getting rid of that Luma again. Jumping from stage or jumping from the ledge with up air. Interesting options from IDK. Here we go, a couple uh, little down B action coming right now, and the up air. And I okay. See, that's the cool thing about these character loyalists who, who like stay like their main from Smash 4 is like uh -huh. they just continue to do Smash 4 stuff. 
and it just works out for him. That up air killing DK, a pretty good, <laughs> at, at, at pretty good percentage. Yeah, it wasn't even like a Luma up air. That was just straight Rosalina's. That was all her. That was all her galaxy power. Yep, that was all her. All, all crown, all magic. Ooh. Ooh! Give him the foot, though. What size is that, 28 DK? Oh, step on her. <laughs> I don't care. Oh, no. Wind up Come punch on. not gonna not gonna work this time. IDK got it once in game one. Yeah, probably watch. not gonna see another one. Really connect. Yeah, I like the uh, I like the tenacity right here by Janine. Try to go after DK like while he's off stage, force him to try to recover, make it a little bit awkward for him. Okay, oh, big big coverage with the forward air. And now dropping with the nair. Ooh, oh, the kind of guarding, kind of going ham right now with the nairs. Okay. Yeah, a little unfortunate for IDK that it sent uh, Zenhin. Onto the stage, but still IDK able to continue the pressure, landing a grab into a forward throw. We go more in the, the back air train about to start, and yeah, you gotta be careful with the way you recover IDK. You see another wind up punch, did a good amount of shield pressure, and got rid of Luma. Wow, and this the spacing of his jabs is able to like get him, like make him just a little bit safe. But this is like, man, you wish that wasn't safe. You wish he could uh, have a follow up after that, but. Or IDK could not. Okay, well, IDK jumping from the ledge. That invincibility is on. Just putting IDK right back on the ledge. Yep, and I like the weight on that. Good on IDK. IDK handling this very, very well, making all the right decisions. Okay, had the right idea with the, the short hop up, throw, up air. Just uh, roll animation just a little bit too low to actually catch. Yeah, trying to go for that little wave bounce with that down being... Uh, my man is uh, in disadvantage, and Zanin, he needs to take a little bit better advantage of it, considering that he doesn't have a lead right now. Mm -hmm. Right now, it's IDK's momentum. While Zen is like, trying to push his own tempo onto IDK, IDK, while he continues to like, get pushed off the stage, it's not enough to actually take a stock, so really it's just burning time that IDK is willing to burn. Yeah, Zanin, uh, I would say go for the, okay, you know what, let me just shut up. I'm going to be quiet. I was going to say go for the riskier plays, but, like, when you have a tool with armor that can kill you at, like, percent like that, that's the tool that needs to be used. So good on IDK, evening up the, the, the set right now, so it's 1-1. One, one. I mean, the tenacity from IDK, I'm surprised that he continued to utilize the, the wind-up punch, especially after, like, getting punished really hard in uh, earlier in game two. Well, I mean, in a situation like that, you kind of... Yeah, you have the risk reward. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, okay, this is armored. He's not respecting my space. I'm going to let it rip. So, But even if he tries to hit me with these low knockback moves, it ain't going to do nothing to me. I'm DK. So I understand on uh, IDK's part, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so it's the moment of truth. Game three. Is he going to rock it with... You going to do it? Gonna... Yes. Three games of Donkey Kong from IDK. I mean, it's Congo soccer, bro. Show, yeah, pay, pay homage, baby. This is the time to do it. So here we go. IDK is the name one one between these guys on Smashville. So a little bit of advance for Rosalina and Luma since she got that platform, that little house. You can kind of just, you know, let Luma do her thing. Okay. Got caught between uh, Luma and Rosalina, but unfortunately for Zen and Spacing, wasn't quite there. IDK was like in the sweet spot. <laughs> yeah. Where he wasn't at an, in danger. <laughs> yeah. And uh, what IDK kind of wants here is to just to like, oh, try to go for the wave bounce down, but you're not going to get it. Um, what IDK wants is like, he wants to start a fight. He wants to start like a brawl. He doesn't want like Zanine to start, you know, spamming star bits. Oh, no. Leave the leave He's going to be able to make it back, alone. though. He's going to be able to make it back. Just got to keep mashing up. Oh, but he re uh, Zin him very smart, repositioning Luma right above ledge, but. Able to grab onto the ledge. That was a miracle, to be honest with you. That was, that a, was a blessing from Congo Saga. <laughs> Still not going to die yet. And, uh, oh, that, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He yeah. went pretty far off. You earned it, Zinin. Yeah. You went deep for it. Slipping with it, trying to get the uh, the wind up punch uh, oh. going. <laughs> Do you see how Luma, while, while uh, Zinin got grabbed, Luma was swinging but just not able to connect? There you go. A little ledge guard happening from IDK. Very nice. And that Nair just got buffed, too, so pretty pretty reliable uh, option if you want to, you know, start the ledge guarding. Yeah, in perfect time for Congo Saga. Hmm. <laughs> oh, how ironic. Uh, somebody must be watching. <laughs> Cranky, Ghost of Cranky, is that you? You watching over my man's DK right now? You should be because this man getting comboed 90% on him, and now this yes. is foul. This, is, this isn't okay. Come on, yo. 
Okay, well, repositioning Luma. Unfortunately, if it's in, in, or in the cor incorrect position to keep IDK off stage, still tr the fact that Zenit has control over Luma is able to really maneuver the puppet around in, in a good position like that. Like, no. my man Zenit has no, well, okay, see, I say things and then they don't happen. Like, come on, man. No, right. no don't, one's don't no get one's hit by the wind up. <laughs> I was gonna say, no one's home <laughs> for that, bro. That's the that's the hypno smash right there. You know, like run into this. <laughs> okay, I was gonna say, get your down tilt going. You're gonna need to get your combos going if you want to catch up. And, okay, now she she's kind of like oh, ten away yeah, from even kill percent, even percent. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a huge punch! Huge punch coming out from Zenin. Only getting a forward air, but that's gonna put. IDK in a really bad position, but using the side B and the armor that it has to make sure it nullified any aggression that Zinhin was about to throw out. Very smart from IDK. Now Zinhin still chasing off stage. IDK saying all the pep and all the patience in the world is able to come back from that deficit and finally dying, but he was able to put 103%. I, I thought he could die from that back here. Man, it been another revenge kill from an, from IDK. <laughs> oh. yeah, getting the sour spot of the, uh, the up tilt, not going to kill just yet. Okay, good forward air. Here comes the offstage pressure. No, Zenhin just setting up the ledge traps. And with the Luma sucker punch. <laughs> wow, he wasn't able to get the armor frames off in time for the up being and stopped it. That jab from Zenin. And at 162, come on, cargo throw, back, cargo throw, back throw will easily kill her. But going for the nair on the edge guard again, and now we have pretty much even stocks right now. Yeah, game three, last stock apiece. Winner's side on the line. Good amount of pressure on the on the platform from Zanin. Yeah, I like the concept of trying to go for Luma to get the kill, but it wasn't enough to kill Luma. And here we go. Going to try to just reset neutral here. And then this is going to be his time to strike. Luma's Ooh. dead. Oh, yes. Oh. oh, no jump on deck. That's oh, OK. I don't know if IDK realized that uh, Zanin didn't have the jump. Wow, and just all the edge guarding in the world not getting a. Uh, oh my goodness, barely missing the giant punch. Yeah, there was an angel looking out for DK, and now there's an angel looking out for Zanin. Luma taking the punch. Oh, missing the grab here. What's the move? Zanin going for the dare, not going to be able to get it. Yeah, but unfortunately, it took so much time for IDK to make it back to the stage that Luma is back. Now dropping with an arrow. Unfortunately, we have a reverse situation. Forward is going to connect for Zanin. What was that? Come on, yo. Come on, yo. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> yo, that's the pop up, man. Bro, you're looking at the screen like, bro, what was this hitbox, bro? You let Luma just finish the job for you? I mean, that's what you got by the That's what for, Luma's right? hired for. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Luma's just putting in the, you know, that's the nine to five star. You're not my family. You're my workers. <laughs> do my job. <laughs> do my bidding. Kill kill this DK I mean, for that's, me. I mean, that's definitely how I view Rosalina. This is, this is not a partnership. This is a business. This is a business, and uh, you know we and gotta get more stock in Lumas. It's so it's so trash that like 